I might do my first Twilight mission. But first, let's check out the hidden tea house. Um. Wait, first let's level up, actually. Let's see my guardian spirit that I just got, Itakuri. Actually requires 16 spirits, so let me go ahead and put that on now. It's a spider. Yeah, of course, it's a spider. But let me raise my spirit to 16. I think I'm at 15 right now. Yeah, I'm at 15. So I'll make it be 16. Very good. And let's take a look at this spirit. Alright, so... <clears throat> It's the same spirit protection, 20%, but it actually gives me plus 50 luck, which is pretty damn cool. That would really help with my item. And then look, human item drop rate and yokai item drop rate. Damn, you use this spirit if you want to farm for rare items, basically. Because look, everything else, uh, it's an earth spirit, but the attack enhancement is less. The usable time is less. The might is less. Uh, better action, but less recovery, less tenacity, and more amrita gauge rate. So this spirit... Basically, like if you want to go on farming runs, equip Itokuri. Yeah. Okay, gotcha. All right, well, I'm going to keep the Paired Raikin on because as you could see, Paired Raikin is damn good out on bosses and everything. That was so freaking... That was crazy how I destroyed that spider boss. Okay. All right, so let's check out the hidden tea house. The clan battle information... Oh, never mind. All right, here we go. <laughs> It's always nice to see a customer. This tea room is my pride and joy, a place that straddles our realm and the other world, but I suspect you have realized this already. I hear that you have taken to playing at being a warrior. But a warrior fights not for himself, his efforts are all for the good of his clan. Perhaps it's time you joined one too. Now look into my Hirogomu kettle. Damn, look at this. Wow, look at this. So I have to join a clan here? Wow, yeah, look, I have to join a clan. Holy crap. There's more! Oh my god, there's so many! <laughs> there's so many! Okay. Wow, damn. Which clan do I join? If I analyze... Oh my god, there's so many! Holy crap! Wow. Wait, what? Look at this, Tokugawa. Prevents death as long as you are not in a critical state. Critical condition. 30%. Wait a minute. Does that mean if I'm... Critical condition would be um, when I'm out of stamina and it's red and I'm like, like this and I can't move. So this means I can't be one-shotted unless um, in that state, then they have to attack me again to kill me. Huh. I'm ready to earn from enemies and money earned from enemies. Nah. Close combat attack with the spear. I don't really use spears, so that's not... When you're finished using a living weapon, a living weapon attack enhancement. Alright, so Ishida is kind of like the living weapon one. I don't know which one to, to pick here. I don't use a Kusari Gama, so that's not good. Evasion attack boost and familiarity bonus. Close combat attack. Enemy with stat on an enemy with a status ailment. Damage reduction when attacking and plus 10 to earth damage. Oh my god, there's so many! Yokai close combat attack with a sword. That's actually may that may be good. And enemy defense lowered by 20%. Key regeneration plus 30%. That's good. Bow damage. Lightning damage and key reduction for status. Oh my god, there's so many. Those are like grenades. The Kyokudama and Hirokudama. Damage half. That full life. That's cool. And skill damage plus 7. That's actually cool. The damage is... The first attack I receive when I'm at full life is half. That's good. No key consumption while guarding. 10%. Hmm. When you, whenever I use an elixir, I would cure all my status ailments. Wow, that's really good. Holy crap. 
If I'm poisoned, burning, whatever. I use an elixir. I don't have to worry about antidotes or anything. It'll just heal me. But I don't know about that. Guess what? Look. Durability of living weapons and living weapon duration. I actually might want this one. Because I, I really like the living weapon mechanic. And of course, as you saw, it just saved my ass at that boss fight. I actually might do Date here. It's probably not Date. It's probably Date. But I might do Date. Let's, let's look at the rest of them. That's for an axe. I don't think Nox uh, played Neo. Yeah, I'm gonna do the living weapon thing. Where's it at? Right here, Date. Durability of living weapons and living weapon duration. I think I'm gonna pick this one. What do you guys think? What Arcade and Nox, what would you guys recommend? But I think I'm going to do Living Weapon, the Living Weapon one, Date. Really sad day. Which one should I pick then, Arcade? What do you think? Yeah, I'm picking Date. You will pledge allegiance to Date. Yes. Okay. Clay trade clan battles, transfer, and transform. Okay, so transform. All I have is William. I don't have any other appearances yet. Maybe because I have to go online or trade. Oh, trade probably. Here we go. So, glory is what you get when you defeat a revenant. And I've been defeating revenants here and there throughout the playthrough so far. So I have 176 glory right now. You went for the no key lost on guard. Yeah, that is a pretty good, pretty good mechanic. But I, I, I want to increase the, the durability and the length of my living weapons. What is this? Oh, prestige titles. You can gain back all your prestige points. Okay, wow. Hank of Yokai here. Oh, cool. But I'm gonna do that Twilight mission, so that's alright. I'm actually gonna get the last one that I need right now. Um. Oh, here's all the transforming things. Hattori Hanzo, Kuroda Nagamasa, Tachibana Munashinje. Tachibana is like the same armor that I have on now, though. Kobuya Kawa Hideaki and a Revenant. Wow, you can actually transform into a Revenant. That's pretty damn cool. Um, masterpieces. You're about to obtain an uncommon or rare sword at random. You may even obtain exotic equipment. Okay, so this is like a gamble. You can gamble for exotic items and stuff. And then different gestures as well. It's pretty damn cool, man. I like this. Alright, well, I'm going to save my glory because I want to get the transformations, which is going to be pretty cool. Um, cool. Alright, nice. I'm not going to get anything from him yet. I'm going to do my first Twilight mission ever here. Let's see. 